Hi beauties, welcome to the channel. Today I'm going to be testing out another eyeshadow hack using a spoon. I'm very curious and excited how it's going to turn out. So let's get started. First I'm going to prime my eyelids using Gerard Cosmetics Clean Canvas Eyeshadow Base. I'm going to apply the base all over my lid up to my brow bone and I'm going to blend out softly using a flat fluffy brush from Urban Decay Cosmetics. And now it's time to test out this hack. I'm going to use this small spoon that fits my eyelid perfectly. I'm going to hold the spoon in a horizontal lifted way because I want to create a lifted cut crease look here. Then I'm going to pick up this uh, brown shadow using a flat shader brush and I'm going to line using the spoon as my guide and I'm going to go back and forth with that eyeshadow to cut the crease. And there we have that sharp cut crease line there. Then I'm going to hold the spoon on the outer part of my eyelid to create that sharp wing. I'm using the same eyeshadow as well as the same brush. There we have that sharp winged liner there in no time. Wow. Then I'm going to further extend that liner and I'm going to bring it towards the inner part of my eyes. I'm using the same shadow as well as brush. And now using a pencil brush, I'm going in with a mid brown matte shadow and I'm going to blend out that cut crease line there softly. I'm keeping the blending part right above that line. I'm not dragging that eyeshadow below the line because for a cut crease look, we want that line cut crease line to be sharp as well as blended on the upwards because we are going to fill with any eyeshadow below the line or you can also leave it that way. Then I'm going to fill the gap uh, between the lines using this champagne color. I also added a little bit of setting spray. You can of course choose uh, any color of your choice or you can also choose different colors to fill in the gap. Uh, here I'm using a champagne shimmer shadow. I'm just sticking on to some neutral shades. Then I'm adding new liner in the waterline and then I'm going to coat mascara both on my lower lashes as well as on my upper lashes. And there we have the finished look. This was really so easy to create this cut crease look, you guys. It took, I think, a couple of seconds, you know, uh, to draw that cut crease line as well as the wing liner. So easy. And I would say this hack just works uh, fantastic. I mean, you just have to look for the spoon that fits perfectly for your eyelid to create the perfect cut crease. And I would say that it's a very easy method to create a cut crease, especially for beginners. And I just want to know, have you guys tried this hack yet? Or are you guys planning to try? Just let me know in the comment section down below. I would love to read out your comments. And I really hope this video is helpful. It was really fun for me to, you know, uh, film this video. And I'm really happy and surprised that it works and that completes this video guys i really hope you guys liked it do subscribe to my channel if you haven't already for more such hacks tutorials and i will see you guys very soon bye